From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. I'm Power 5 meteorologist Ramisha Shade. I hope you're having a wonderful day. It's going to be a chilly one for April out there today. Highs only around 42 degrees for Cleveland. Mix of clouds and sun. I can't rule out a few snowflakes, maybe a few sprinkles, but the main event holds off until tomorrow, especially during the morning. Widespread snow falling for much of the area and some of that snow will likely accumulate. In fact, through Friday, one to three inches of snow, a good bet for Cleveland, maybe up to two to four inches back to the west around Sandusky and Norwalk. So a few slick spots potentially out there for tomorrow. We'll be watching it closely. Stay safe. Enjoy the rest of your day. Danita. Thank you, Ramisha. And here are your top stories. Another 5.2 million workers filed for jobless benefits across the country last week, bringing the total number to 22 million in the last four weeks. That's roughly 13.5 percent of the workforce. Here in Ohio, more than 158,000 new claims were filed last week, bringing the total to 855,000 in the past month. Both the federal and state government are working on a plan to restart the economy while still slowing the spread of COVID-19. Onot is seeing far fewer drivers on the roads these days as many people work from home. But the agency says that's not translating to a safer environment for construction workers. They've been hit nine times since Valentine's Day, with the most recent one happening on March 27th. Tomorrow you can get a hot meal at the Akron Zoo. Block 15 Brewing Company and Riley Hotel Group have teamed up to serve drive through meals and all you have to do is show up at the Akron Zoo parking lot between 1 and 3 tomorrow afternoon. It's first come first served and meals will be available in servings of 4. We'll have another update for you later tonight. Until then, check the News 5 app for the latest stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.